In other words, Marshal, you owe me $200. We have all been waiting a very long time for this. The guy who brought us making memes in your basement at 3am has returned with his next campaign. Steal Roblox games to pay grandpa's bail tycoon. This is the game nobody saw coming. Not the masterpiece we needed, but the masterpiece we deserved. I think this is a very interesting title. Steal Roblox game. Hmm, could this have anything to do with this guy's game? Maybe a hint hint nudge nudge towards that? I don't know, maybe I'm just making that up. It seems a little weird on timing. That other devs are starting to hop on Joshua's style, and then he makes a game about stealing Roblox games. I don't want to jump to any conclusions. Maybe I'm reading too deep into this. Your gramps just got locked up because he was doing some risky business, and you can no longer spend quality time with him. You decide to start a business copying Roblox games in his RV to save him and find the truth. I mean, it seems pretty cut and dry to me. I think he's calling out the other dev. Chemistry. It is the study of... What? Anyone? Time's up, Gramps. We know what you did. And now, you're going to jail. Yeah. I am the danger. Grandpa, no! No! Oh, no! Ooh. He was gonna teach me chemistry! First things first. Slap dead. Snap out of it. We gotta save Gramps. We hop on the PC. And then we create a game. But first, we have to steal one of these games. We can't create our own game. That's too hard and boring. Oh, wait. Hey, this is a good game. We can steal this one. Oh, no way! No! No! This whole game is just a rose towards the other developer. Oh, my God. You can't make this up. And I got $3. Oh, wonderful. I feel no remorse, no regret. Let's expand my RV. Oh, it's what? <laughs> so much more room. It's one of those fancy RVs. It looks all tiny from the outside, and you go inside, and it's like a Harry Potter tent. Okay, let's steal another Roblox game. I think this time I'm gonna steal from this guy named Joshua. He has some pretty cool games, but my game's gonna be cooler. There it is. I can't, I can't believe- Money! Money! I can't believe this whole game is just a roast. Oh, hey, are you building the game we're playing right now? <laughs> That's so crazy. Crappy ripoff. <laughs> oh my god. Under day time wasters. Dummies. What game are we going to steal today? Which one of Joshua's games are we stealing today? Spellbound Wizard RPG, my favorite game. I can't wait to remake Wizard RPG. Hey, dude, wake up. Unique gameplay mechanic. Wake up. I mean, it was unique until it was, well, somebody stole it. I even got my dead fish from the other Roblox game. This entire game is just a callback to Joshua's <laughs> other Roblox games. So if you haven't seen those videos, this video is going to be extremely confusing. All right, third friend hired. Look at that. If it makes dollars, it makes sense. What else can I say? It's a doggy dog world. Soon we will have an entire army of game stealers. No game will ever be original ever again. Every game will simply be a repackaged version of a different game. It's the future. It's the future. It's time to hire somebody to keep these guys in check. They keep falling asleep. How am I supposed to make millions stealing games from other people? <laughs> if they're sleeping, they can't be sleeping. This guy. Do it. Go. Get out there, champ. Good game, champ. Good but nice goal. So check it out. We got this giant mask. He says, come on, baby. You know, he says a lot of encouraging things like that. And for some reason, that makes people steal games for me faster. Let the hacking begin. I thought we were just stealing game ideas. But now we're straight up stealing games. We're stealing the code, the builds, everything. We're just re-uploading games. We're in. I, I, I don't know about this, Mr. Mask. On top of already stealing me ideas, I mean, that's pretty messed up. It's beautiful. I mean, yeah, I guess it's cost effective we don't have to build anything ourselves but i mean don't you think that's a little morally wrong i mean the idea is one thing but i invented it you got me feeling all weird about this like at first i thought it was fine like whatever now you got me thinking about my actions now that we have a hundred fans we can acquire grandpa's lab equipment how does this help I have no idea. I think Joshua forgot to anchor these parts. They are vibrating. I don't know if that's by design, but it doesn't look safe. We're outgrowing the concrete room. We have to expand this trailer even further behind the mask. Oh, is that a dungeon? Do I smell a dungeon? Oh, 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 oh. I think that's a dungeon. Money. 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 I love money. Money. I love money. Give me money. Money. I need more money. Oh, the dungeon. I love the dungeon. Nothing is better 
than a deep dark place where I can throw my enemies. Like this guy. I don't know why I hate him so much, I just do. And now he works for me in the deepest, darkest part of my trailer. I have a strategy for optimizing money making. I go to the computer, I make three games in a row, then I jump off my computer, run over to the dungeon, jump in, wake all these guys up, and then repeat the process. It's strenuous, okay? I'm stressed Money. out. Someone's gotta steal all these Roblox games. Money. If I don't do it, someone else is just gonna do it. So it might as well be me. We're just about ready to expand the dungeon. We have an ace slapper here with an ax on his back. That's just to scare him into working harder. He doesn't actually use the ax, unless he has to. Okay, we're expanding the RV sweatshop. Oh, another beautiful concrete room. Look at it, 72,000. Ah! That's a lot of stones. That's a lot of doubloons. These rooms are getting pricey. A little bit too pricey for the likes of me. All right, these two losers are the last people I'm hiring. I can't afford to hire anybody else. You guys are getting too expensive. You want too much for me. Well, boys, it looks like it's that time of the video again where I'm getting bored and I almost have enough money to end the game. This has been a wonderful adventure and a learning experience, I think, for all of us. It doesn't matter how much money you would like to have. Maybe you shouldn't steal things from other people. That's the moral. There you go. Wrap it up in a nice bow. If you real jump, watch this. Ooh! Dang, man, we got football and basketball. W YouTuber, thank you, man. Yo, shout out to my boy Swizzy and my home dog, Jajetta. Okay, I'm done. I'm reformed. I'm no longer stealing games starting at $1 million. All I want to do is spend time with my grandpa. I see you got the bail money, but uh, your grandpa actually likes it here in jail. No. I have spent my whole life scared. Grandpa, please come home. Frightened of things that could happen, might happen, might not happen. 50 years I spent like that. But you know what? Ever since my entire life behind bars, I sleep just fine. No, Grant, no! Your grandpa left you a gift? Why did he give me a gift? I spent a million dollars and he didn't even get out of jail. That's not how bail works. Where's my gift? What is this? Sorry, I can't leave jail. I left you some crystal candy. Pure and right from my lab. P.S. You are badass. Thank you. Uh, thank you, grandpa. Thank you. Love you. Love you, gramps. Love you. Ha ha ha.